Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are well and staying safe. I'm here to do a VR for Natasha, who is Polite Creations here on YouTube. She is hosting a 600 subscriber challenge on her YouTube channel. And for this challenge, she just wanted you to create something crafty, and like a memory decks card, whatever you wanted, it was crafter's choice, and you would get a point for that. If you did a video response, you'd get another point, and if you created a couple of masculine embellishments, that would be another point. So she's basing this off of a point system. I had seen Scrap the World do a tutorial for an embellishment box on her channel, and thought, hmm, I wanted to try it. And you guys, it is so easy, so simple. I'm going to be making a lot more of these. Um, this is what I created for her. I used the Terrace Bloom paper that you get from Hobby Lobby, and I used maybe two sheets out of the whole pack. So this is what I created. I did not create the embellishment book that Tamika did on her channel, but I did something else instead. I also added this um, handle to it to make it look more like a purse, and I put a couple of gems on the sides of it. I also attached this dangle that I created. I made a few of these in February, and I had one left over, so I am gifting this to her. Her favorite color is gold, so I hope she likes this. This paper has a rose gold color foil on it, so I have a rose a rose gold color bow here, and this trim as well is the same color. I have some flower it's made out of paper here, and some paper leaves as well in the yellow and pink, just to give it a punch of color. For the flap here, I did, oh, and I also have this ruffle trim that I think I purchased on eBay. This flap here is magnetic, so it's easy to stay closed. And on the inside, I have the swan paper that has foiling on the beak. Let me show you what I have inside here. I have these bows that I created. I use a Spellbinders die for this. And I have two pink ones and a black one in the middle here. And they have the paper flower on the top. And I kept the bag topper simple because you couldn't do too much to it, otherwise it wouldn't fit in here. And I put some gems on the top and a bow. And then I have these flowers here that I created, a whole bunch of these. I have more of them on my Instagram if you want to see the other colors that I've done. And they all have different centers, flower centers on them. And I really like that a lot. For the topper, all I did was did some pom-pom trim and a strip of some gold bling at the top. Just to keep it simple. I also gave her some silver and pink crepe paper rosettes that I created. And then I gave her these masculine embellishments. I do not have anything masculine in my stash, so I really struggled with this one. I have this layered die here that I got from In Love Arts last year sometime. And someone had gifted me these um, camera stickers, so I chose a few colors that might be good for boys. And then someone else gave me these stickers here around Valentine's Day, and I thought these puppies were really cute, so I added that. And then instead of having a bag topper here, I just have this little piece here um, with one of these shapes and a heart and it says smile and then I dangle some ribbon on the bottom of it. So that's what I created for her. And just to show you one more time, the side, the back, I have my sticker on here. So that's what I created for her. So I hope she likes it. Congratulations on your growing channel, Natasha. I hope it continues to grow. You're an amazing crafter. I love watching your videos. And I hope all goes well for you and your family as you anticipate the arrival of your little one. And I hope you all stay safe and um, just stay at home, you guys. Let's do our part to rid ourselves of this virus that's spreading so rapidly. All right, you guys, take care. There's more pictures that are going to be posted on my Instagram channel or my Instagram page if you guys want to see this in more detail. You guys take care, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye-bye.